We won yesterday's free betting pick, which was in the NBA. I recommended to grab Brooke Lopez from the Milwaukee Bucks to record over 21.5 points plus assists plus rebounds. He finished with 20 points, 12 rebounds and 1 assist for a total of 33, which easily exceeded the betting line of 21.5. Way to go, guys! Now, in this video, I would like to share with you a NHL pick that is supported by three of my 10 NHL betting systems. I'm Professor MJ, University Statistics Teacher. Let me give you all the details in a short while. Here's my daddy, Professor MJ! My favorite betting pick in the National Hockey League for Thursday, January 12 is the Buffalo Sabres, hosting the Winnipeg Jets. The best line I could get this morning was plus 113 in American format with the Bet Online Sportsbook or 2.13 in decimal odds. Like I said earlier, Buffalo qualifies under three different betting angles that I developed after analyzing data on nine NHL seasons. Let me discuss one of those betting strategies that I've decided to call the Hot Scorers. One aspect that I appreciate about this system is that it fits my contrarian approach, where I tend to go against conventional wisdom. In this case, following the hot scorer system will lead you to bet against teams that have been hot offensively in their most recent games. Let me give you the specifics. Suppose the road team has scored a minimum of four goals in each of their past three games, which don't necessarily have to be wins, by the way. In that case, bet the home team. By doing so over nine years, you would have earned a profit of 45.08 units over 332 bets, a 13.6% ROI. Let's verify that it applies to the Winnipeg vs Buffalo matchup after this quick break. As you can see on your screen, the Winnipeg Jets have scored 5, 7 and 4 goals respectively in their past 3 matches. That fits the criterion of having scored a minimum of 4 goals in each of their last 3 contests. Since Winnipeg is indeed the road team, then according to the hot scorers betting strategy, we must fade them. And therefore we are taking the Sabres in this spot. Let me clarify something. I don't follow my betting systems blindly. I also incorporate my own analysis of each game, and I also have a statistical model that estimates each team's winning probability. In this case, my model believes Buffalo holds close to a 50% chance of winning this matchup, so getting positive odds makes it a good value wager. Moreover, I have noticed that the Jets hold a 2-5 record the last 7 times they faced a team with a winning record. Meanwhile, you may be surprised to hear that Buffalo is 4-1 the last 5 times they squared off against a team with a winning percentage above 600, which is quite impressive. We have made money in the NHL this season whether on sides, totals or prop bets. We have also racked up some profit in the NFL and a lot of gains in the NBA, particularly with the money-making NBA prop bets for which we hold a 50 and 30 record right now. Since December 25, they have posted a jaw-dropping 15 and 3 record. Why not join the numerous other smart sports investors on my Patreon page for just $4.25 per day? By doing so, you'll receive between 30 and 40 picks per week, directly in your mailbox. I'm Professor MJ, holder of a 
PhD in statistics, have a nice day.